Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov slash apod. And today's picture for April 7th of 2023. Well, it is titled Rigel Wide. So what do we see here? Well, here we're looking toward the constellation of Orion, and this is no, the star known as Beta Orionis, and that is also known by the name of Rigel. And it is a very hot blue star, not quite a thousand light years away. And it is an extremely a hot star, much hotter than our own sun. And it is a, a comparable in brightness to the bright star Betelgeuse, which is Alpha Orionis. And these are very massive stars and may eventually become supernovae. Now that happens at the end of the life of a massive star. Now if these two stars do become supernovae, they are in different stages of that uh, point. In fact, the Rigel because Rigel is a blue giant star, and Betelgeuse is a red super giant star. So they are different colors, meaning that they're different temperatures, Rigel being much hotter than Betelgeuse. And they are also different in size. So for example, this is about the size, Rigel is about the size of Mercury's orbit. So from the center of our sun out to Mercury's orbit, Betelgeuse is a little bit even larger than that. Now here we can see that area around it around the dusty regions and gaseous regions of the Orion star forming region, uh, which Rigel is a portion of. And just to the right hand side, the dusty region being illuminated by Rigel is known as the Witch Head Nebula. And we also see up above and to the left of Rigel, the Orion Nebula, a very uh, a compact nursery of new stars that are still in the process of formation. So we see a lot of things going on in the Orion region. It is a very intense star forming region within our galaxy, still forming stars to this day. And we also see those bright stars. Here we see Rigel, Betelgeuse not being visible in this image. But we can see Rigel here, one of the brightest stars in the constellation of Orion and one of the brightest stars we see in the sky uh, that is present here and its light illuminates some of this gas illuminates some of the gas the reddish color around it. And it also illuminates some of the dusty regions around as well. So all in all, we see a lot of star formation within uh, or within the Orion region. And here we're concentrating and looking in towards the specific part around the bright star Rigel. So that was our picture of the day for April 7th of 2023. It was titled Rigel Wide. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be medieval times. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone. And I will see you in class.